Hi everyone, I'm in the UK at a polemics conference dealing with Islam and I met my friend John here who's an ex-Muslim but I have to ask how can you be, how could you have been a Muslim, your name is John? Well, I am now a follower of the Lord Jesus Christ and when I became Christian I, um, I read the Gospel of John and I I was in love with how uh, the John, the, the Gospel of John said in the beginning was the Word and the Word was God and the Word became flesh and I choose to become John, a new God, a new faith, a new life with the Lord Jesus Christ. And so you're from Yemen, why don't you go ahead and, why don't you just go ahead and uh, tell us how you uh, ended up leaving Islam and uh, becoming a Christian. So I grew up in Yemen into a Muslim family, uh, into a devoted to Muslim family, and my family taught me how to pray, how to fast, how to read Quran. And uh, 2014, I want to. I was doubtful about Islam because I felt there is no spiritual connection between me and God, the Creator. And this is we I ended up to go to Mecca. I was the luckiest one to go to Mecca, the house of Allah. And in Mecca, I was going around the block, uh, the house of Allah, and I I realized this is human being made. This is not from God. Mm -hmm. And there, in front of Kaaba, I. I rejected Islam. I give up Islam in front of Kaaba, and that was very hard. Wait, just to be clear, you became an apostate from Islam in front of the Kaaba. In front of Kaaba, in the, in the front of the most holy place of Islam, the capital of Islam. Wow. So, uh, so, uh, when, what happened after that? After that, I was agnostic for three years. It was the most hardest life in my, the most hardest three years in my life, because in Islam, as you said, if you are apostate, if you denied Islam, if you rejected Islam, there is a hadith: whoever changed his religion should be killed. Mm -hmm. So I have to be secret for three years. It was very hard. Then I um, I left Yemen and I met Christians and they taught me about Jesus Christ and I start to read the the Gospel of uh, Matthew and the, te the teaching of Jesus Christ, the Sermon in the Mount, and that changed my life upside down. I said, this is the God I'm looking for. Mm. This is the God who died for me and rose again. He's alive. He loved me so much that he died on the cross and rose again. So I gave my life to Jesus Christ. I became new, a new creation, a new believer, and this is why I choose the, I become John. And now God called me to, sh to share my faith with, with the whole nations, and with my people, with Yemenis, because I always declare Yemen for Christ. Oh, they really need it down there. Of course, they, they need the really, Lord Jesus. They really, really need it down there. Yeah, yeah. They yeah. need the Lord Jesus Christ. Abs Everybody need the Lord. Everyone, everyone need, need the Lord Jesus Christ. Absolutely. So, how can people uh, follow your work? So, my name is John Ghanim on an Instagram. I, they call me TikToker John. Um, uh, and on TikTok, Facebook, uh, YouTube, John Ghanim. And I will put the links to all those in the description box. Thanks, brother. Thank you so much. Uh, it's an honor to meet you. And you are one of the uh, kafir, one of the most uh, infidels in the world yes. against Islam. The kafir king. <laughs> God bless you. Thank you.